while planning a writing course we'll have to make another important decision apart from goals and institutional constraints we'll have to plan make decisions about the content to be included because making decision about the right content can help students understand the dynamics of writing and that can also diminish or affect their motive uh, i mean play important role in terms of encouraging them or motivating them so there are number of decisions to be made regarding the content um and i would like to discuss some of the key debates taking place which um which can help us see uh, the decision about content to be included in the writing co course whether we would like to we want our students to write about their personal experiences this is important decision and i have seen that asking students to write about their personal experiences can offer a positive springboard and that can enhance their ability to write and of course it can be messy phenomenon but eventually students can become efficient in terms of uh, when they write about their personal experiences for example we can ask them how was their eid holidays how was their trip to the northern areas how how has been your their experiences of studying that particular course this this is how uh, encouraging students to write about their personal experiences can be helpful then the social issues confronted by the world at large and uh, or um, pakistani context in particular so social issues there are a range of social issues and social issues writing about social issues will require specific kind of vocabulary sentence structure organization synthesization or cultural issues um whether it it the celebration of basant should be allowed or not so this is sort of cultural issue then making them read literature and write about the themes which they explore in poetry in fiction in short stories in dramas or content of other subjects for example science subjects engineering subjects or mathematics so the whole idea is to see writing as a unique tool to language learning right not to make them master the language rather to learn the language for writing so the idea is to make them discover learning not just demonstration of learning again this leads us to this refers to the concept of treating writing as a process not as a product by as a product is like just just like depositing money in the bank and withdrawing those money and process involves lot of stages lot of elements for example brainstorming then uh, putting ideas into words and then uh, using those words into sentences then writing the first draft and then submitting it for the feedback and then revising it then editing it then finalizing it and then submitting it or um, showcasing it or sending it to the teacher so what content will encourage students to use writing for communication this is important element and as as language teachers will have to make decision sometimes encouraging students to write scientifically may not be encouraging for them and sometimes asking them to write about the social issues can be motivating for them or the cultural issues can be motivating for them so this is important decision to use writing as a unique tool for communication and remember now with the coming of um, 
artificial intelligence with the coming of so many online applications websites blogs we can encourage uh, even the use of social media we can encourage students to use social media for writing so the main purpose of including content is to make our students critical thinker who can examine who are engaged and whose ideas are improved